In this video, I'm going to show you two different methods for cleaning this Roman blind. My name is Carl, I'm a material specialist from Ireland, and this is another video from Cleaning How To. On this channel, we teach you how to clean various things you're going to have in your own home to a professional standard. If you'd like to see more of our videos, click on the subscribe button below. With that being said, let's get to the cleaning. The two methods I'm going to teach you are a wet cleaning method and a dry cleaning method. Nice and simple and you should have everything at home. I'll go into the best method for cleaning your blinds a little bit later but for now you will need rubbing alcohol, dish soap, cotton towels, a vacuum with a soft brush head and a bucket. To start we're going to vacuum the dust out of the material, preferably with a HEPA filtered vacuum cleaner. HEPA filtration will filter out dust mites and allergens. I have a video here that will teach you all about controlling allergens in your home with proper vacuuming with HEPA filter. But for the blind cleaning, 95% of the dirt in the fabric is going to be removable dry, which means that we can essentially get the blind 95% cleaned without using any moisture. The one exception to this is that if you have a greasy kitchen blind, you're probably going to need to skip a step and use rubbing alcohol to remove the grease before using a low moisture cleaning method to fully clean the blind. So with that being said, we're gonna gently vacuum the blind down to remove all of the dry soil. Once the blind is vacuumed, we can then assess the condition of the blind and decide which method we're going to use to clean it, a low moisture method or a dry cleaning method. So with a dry cleaning method, if the blind is quite clean and you just wanna give it a freshen up, it's really quick and easy to use a dry cleaning solvent or rubbing alcohol to indirectly wipe the blind down and that's really all you need to do. You only need a couple of sprays of solvent on the towel to activate the remaining soil in the blind and transfer it over to the cleaning cloth. Check the towel after every few wipes to see if the transfer is working and turn the towel to a new fold so that we aren't rubbing dirt into the fabric. Keep going until the entire blind has been cleaned. To wet clean you're going to need a bucket with about five liters of water in it, about a teaspoon of dish soap and a cotton towel. Dip the cotton towel into the cleaning solution. Wring the towel out. And gently wipe across the blind to remove the soil. We're gonna turn the towel about every half foot or so to use a fresh piece of the towel to get the soil out. We're then gonna transfer the dirt into the bucket and continue wiping down the blind. It really is as simple as that. We're just gonna keep wiping the blind down until we have all of the soil transfer out and the blind is clean. This method can be done whilst the blind is still hanging or it can be taken down and done on a table like I'm doing here. You should get pretty good results from the clean and the blind should be transformed. This is called a low moisture or an indirect cleaning method. And what I mean by indirect is rather than spraying a cleaning agent into the blind, we're using the cloth as the medium to get the soil out. This is quite an effective method and you should see the water start to change color as we migrate the soil from the blind to the cloth and then we rinse the cloth in the water. If you wish, you can then tell the blind off to remove any excess moisture and soil. It really is as simple as that and all in for a blind of this size, the process should only take about 15 to 20 minutes. So that's it. Carl here from Cleaning How To, how to clean your Roman blinds yourself at home.